got in, but I don't know if I did it while leaving the cabin hatch open or did I go see it out in the middle of the night and leave it open. But at one point, I got a wave in again. Uh, so what would happen is it would come, it was, it'd be so kind of big, it would hit the, um, the back of the cabin and almost sweep up the top of the cabin and drop in uh, into the hatch. And uh, I got it into the face because that's where I, my head would be up there and Gussie would be down the other end and Gussie's feet. So it was a moment of panic. Not panic, but like, you know, you wake up and you're like, ah, oh, Jesus, there's water everywhere. And, uh, I started, uh, thankfully I had a towel left out, so I was able to kind of clean up the, the mess. But I remember I was dabbing Gussie's feet pretty hard, like, and uh, I was like, fuck me, he hasn't woken up load of water in on top of his feet and now I'm uh, like clean like drying his shins and side of his shins and he's not stirring like it just shows you the lack of sensation he has down there I suppose so, uh, but apart from that there was no real hot nothing else of particular interest happened I think during the night it was just uh, uh, just riding this out now and hopefully it won't last too long and we can uh Get back and grab the oars and uh, get to work again.